you guys like property tours, you want to stick around today to check out this $1.3 million completely renovated home right here in Rancho Bel Air. Let's go inside. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Brian Nisley. I'm your local Las Vegas real estate broker. This channel is designed for everything Las Vegas. So whether it's this property or anything else you want to know about Las Vegas, please reach out. We love hearing from people all across the world. We love helping you find your dream home right here in the Las Vegas Valley. Let's get into this completely renovated two-story home right here in Rancho Bel Air. Step inside. So let's get up in the air and get a shot of this neighborhood and the surrounding area. Let's go. As we walk up, you guys, I want to talk about a little bit about this community, Rancho Bel Air, the one of the most prestigious equestrian guard gated communities right here in downtown Las Vegas. So we're right near downtown. We've got Scotch 80s next door. We've got McNeil Estates, all of these uh, classic Las Vegas neighborhoods. And as you walk up, we see we've got the three car garage here and a beautiful A-frame of this property. As it comes down, you've got the covered patio as we walk into the front front yard. All of this plants and vegetation out here, I think they need to be trimmed up a little bit, but this is nice as you walk up. Got the inviting lime green door as we walk up, but take a look just above you. All that woodwork. Want it. This property is just under 4,500 square feet, built in 1970 and it's five bedrooms and three baths being offered at $1.3 million. So as we walk in, you can see we've got the big windows overlooking the front with the A-frame going all the way up. We've got the metal stair rail that goes all the way up and around. And then lots of storage as you walk in. We've got two storage closets here on both sides. Uh, hidden heat exchanger over here. But let's take a walk over this way first. Walk in here, we've got the living and formal dining area. So you walk in, see they've completely renovated this property. Even got the, uh, need some new batteries. So we walk in here, you can see we've got the big counter island here. Um, electric Z-Line range right here and hood underneath. Um, we've got a cool backsplash on the, on the wall. We've got some gold accents in here. I'm not big on gold, but some people are. Um, as we walk in again, Tile backsplash all the way through, stainless steel sinks, again, gold accents as you walk in. And then the step down of the countertop here makes for a nice little breakfast nook as well. Now, as we walk through, see we've got the big slider that opens up to the pool in the back. We've got a fireplace over here. It looks like this is grandfathered in. This is a wood burning fireplace. So you can bring in the logs, get the smell of wood going. Uh, hopefully you don't burn down the house. They installed a wine cellar right in between the kitchen and the living area as well. Let me know what you think of this. Would you put this here or would it leave this space completely open? I'd like to hear about that. And we've got a nice counter over here as well, with some dark contrast, wine cooler. Um, and then we walk off this way, barn doors leading to your laundry room. You've got a, another closet here for storage for your laundry room. I'm going out to the three car garage. Pebble Tech flooring out here in the garage. We've got a big storage cabinet right here. We've also got another access door out to the backyard through this way. Let's go check out the upstairs. Uh, half bathroom here as we walk up. This is the area I really like the most out of this property. 
Got a stair rail going up. You got the laminate wood flooring throughout, carpet in the bedrooms. So we come over here, got two of the secondary bedrooms on this side. Right here we got a nice view of downtown Las Vegas. You can see Circa Casino right there. So very, very close to downtown. Big, huge closet in this room. Step in bedroom number two. Digital thermostats. Pretty standard these days. Again, got a nice view of the backyard from out here. Lots of grass, diving board, and pool. But we'll see that in just a minute. Full bath over here, dual sinks. Nice big tile, I like the tile in there. But take a look at this as you look up in this big A-frame with all these windows here. Pretty good look. I would definitely uh, have cleaned these windows. Be a nicer look with these windows being cleaned. So get a window cleaner out here. Uh, bedroom number three, full walk-in. There's a big bedrooms too, large bedrooms. This is almost like a second master in there. You know? So bedroom number four right here, Got uh, big doors coming into the bedroom here. Large bedroom. Again, you got a nice window overlooking the pool here. But this bathroom is, is almost similar to the master bath. Got a big walk-in closet. And you got the dark accents on the light, light cabinetry and the big tile floors again in here. And then this bamboo looking tile on the back of the shower backsplash here. Um, no door on here, so it's gonna be nice and breezy when you take a shower, but it's a cool look. Then we'll step into the primary bedroom here. We've got a big closet over here again for storage. Let me step into the primary bedroom. The one thing I noticed about when, as soon as I walk in here is the, uh, the cathedral ceilings here, the A-frame, but it's all the woodwork here, it doesn't seem like there's a lot of insulation in this room, so it's very, very warm. You got these big windows here and these uh, high ceilings. So I don't know if it's the AC or not, but it's definitely warm in here. You walk over here and you've got a massive walk-in closet. Again, this wood ceiling extends down into the master or the primary closet, which is huge. Look at this thing. Got drawers in here, massive closet. And then you've got the primary bath going in here. I just got a really big shower in here. So you've got dual shower heads, little top and bottom with the wands and really big shower. It's also got plenty of storage space down here for all your soaps and shampoos and things like that. Dual sinks. Now we'll go back and take a look at the backyard. So with this property being built in the 1970s, we've got large backyards, we've got lots of grass, and also the pool is very, very deep. We've got a water slide and a diving board, which we don't see too often in these pools here in Vegas anymore. So come on, take a look. This backyard's huge. We've got a big covered patio out here. And then the uh, water slide in the pool. We're gonna get Parker on that slide and show you how to demonstrate how to slide into the pool. All right, and then we've got the big grassy area over here. Looks like the pool needs some water. Got your pool equipment off in the back corner there, nice and tucked away, makes it quiet. And you got your diving board. So I'm gonna dive in and cool off and see you guys in a minute. So thanks for coming on the tour with us of this completely renovated property right here in Rancho Bel Air, 1970s. Right? So this channel is designed for everything Vegas, you guys, whether it's real estate, a lifestyle, anything about this property or any other property, please reach out. We love hearing from people, helping people all across the world find their dream home right here in the Las Vegas Valley. So we'll keep making these videos as long as you keep watching. Do me a favor, like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. It really helps us out. And we will see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.